Today, a celebration of life was held in West Baltimore during the neighborhood's annual boundary block party. And this year, instead of having a huge blowout party like in the past, organizers they chose to honor our experiences over this past year. WJZ live at 11 o'clock tonight, and Amy Kawada has more on their story. Hey, Amy. Hey, Rick. Well, a public memorial is now set up in West Baltimore, right near Pennsylvania Avenue Triangle Park. And today, community members spent their afternoon hanging up pictures of loved ones who are no longer with us and names on trees. Bringing people together across cultures in West Baltimore. No Boundaries Coalition and Jubilee Arts partnered up to once again host its annual Boundary Block Party at Pennsylvania Avenue Triangle Park. Great. This is like one of the first times we were actually able to come out in the community since the pandemic. So we're happy to be back in a safe way. This year, the lives of loved ones lost in the community are also being honored and celebrated. I know that funerals have looked different, mourning has looked different, so we wanted to create a space for those that wanted to. Each picture hanging on the tree symbolizing a life lost this past year. Some from COVID or natural causes, and each orange ribbon symbolizing victims of violence. It's been a hard year. It's been a hard year for everyone. This comes as Baltimore police reports at least 120 homicides so far this year as of Saturday, up 11 from this time last year. The most recent on Saturday night, just after 6, police say a 31 year old woman was shot and killed in the 2400 block of Calverton Heights Avenue, just within 24 hours of a triple shooting on the same block that killed a 31 year old man and sent two people to the hospital. Earlier in the day, police say a 28 year old man died after he was shot in the 4900 block of Liberty Heights Avenue. And organizers say this community garden in West Baltimore will stay up for the next week so people can stop by and pay their respects to the lives lost over the past year. Live tonight, I'm Amy Kawada for WJZ.